Hi, Mr. Gomez. My name is Mike Cross, and I'm the certified arborist. I'm out here at your rental property by FAMU, and I'm here to take a look at this damaged tree on the right side of the house. I'll show you this video interview. Here's the front of the house, and if you look over to the right side, there's evidence of all of the fallen limbs and branch debris that's been coming down. Here's the street and the parking, and you see all the brown is dead leaves from the tree pieces that have fallen. There's one limb. I'll give you an idea of the size. I'll put my foot next to it. It's not very big, but that's just the top portion. There's another larger section here and more over here. It's scattered everywhere. All of this stuff has been falling off of this one tree alone. There's other trees around and they're mildly healthy but this one has got a risk of hitting the neighbor's house more than yours here's the another big limb that's still hanging you can see it attached where it broke off and there's the tree top all the way up there the tree top is already turning yellow meaning it is starting to show signs of near death as well it's not quite dead yet but even though it's not dead it, it I think it needs to come down because of the risk it poses to the neighboring property and people below if you look right there in the center of the screen, there is a big open wound where the tear was done right there. And those two little black spots are a big hollow inside the tree trunk. So there's a big hollow, there's all of this weight above it in this tree. It goes way up there, that's a tall tree, and this is other limbs behind this magnolia. Right, you can see them through the hole right there, there's some limbs. And all around, and then there's a the neighbor's roof right there right next to the tree. So I consider this a high risk tree in that it could hit your house or the neighbor's house and uh, it is large and it does have a very large hole where the wounding and the other limbs have already fallen off. So my, I'm, I'm going to submit a written estimate to you for removal of the tree. I'll price it first for removal of the down limbs and debris, cleanup of that just to immediately satisfy some safety issues and then the secondary price to completely remove the rest of the tree. So thank you for calling us. I hope this was helpful and I will talk to you soon.